sorry my zapito's acting up but i want to preface this video by saying mario asked me to do this he feels like this is the best way to convey his feelings and it's his artwork so i'm going to respect it and do my best to give him what he's asking for these videos my speech what i have to say and i'm also going to give my true opinion i'm not really sure what is even going on at the moment i know we're getting into some form of a disagreement is it doesn't change our love we have for each other i want to start that off before i say what i gotta say that mario will be and always will be the greatest love i've ever known he has done more for me than my own father um he's the greatest example of a man that doesn't mind taking care of me and listening to me but that does not mean he is perfect neither am i we're just two souls trying our best to figure things out and some things we don't always meet in the middle. Welcome to Accent Out TV, where you can watch TV here. <laughs> Let me redo that. Welcome to Accent Out TV, where I like to talk about stuff that nobody else think about. And today is a project that I've been wanting to work on for a long, long time. And I actually had the chance to do it. So, if you clicked on this video, stick around, hear me out, feedback if you like, to see if you understand. Just, I don't talk the best, but I have something I would like to share, and hope you guys can really understand and have the patience to watch this video. So, let's get right to it. This particular stream, by the way, it was dope as fuck. I didn't realize we was making that many funny jokes. But um, I'm probably skipping ahead here. He'll edit the video how he feels. But the reason this stream he pulled up and the reason we're having this discussion is there was a discrepancy towards the middle end of the video. And you probably heard at the beginning of the video where I had jokingly but was kind of serious making a bet that Hey, Mario, do you think you could find someone better than me? And it was kind of like a funny joke because sometimes I feel like he doesn't appreciate me. So I'm like, you know what, bro? If you could find a bad bitch, got her own money, who is as close to me as possible, because I do think I'm literally a solid-ass female. I'm sorry. Like, I can shit on myself for as long as I want to, but at the end of the day, I am a really good person. I'm funny. I'm outgoing. I'm charismatic, but I am not perfect. So I'm like, if you could find someone half as decent as me, and I can meet her and you can get to woo her and find another love. I am totally okay with that. It's been a little drama to the scene. This is why I tell you that I love you when you're here. This is where you tell me that I don't need anything. Then that's when I tell you that you are my everything. Don't be weird about if me and I talking like we're two different people. He's being weird and he's trying to hit on me as if he don't know me. Okay, so I'm a gamer. A little bit about myself. I like to play video games. More on the computer, more than consoles. I don't too much like consoles. But I do have a PlayStation 5, thanks to the person you just heard. That person you just heard is Gaming with Charm. made like this informal bit, and as the video's going on, you're probably already listening to this, but... He basically, basically, after I made the bet, he was like, oh, bet, um, I actually already got someone in mind. Now, when I heard that, the stipulations in my head, and I may not have said it, I was thinking, like, I literally was trying to tell him you could find someone in person that I can meet, and, you know, you love them. Like I say, they got to be half as decent to me. I basically got to know this person, because that was the part of the deal to me. I might not have said it out loud, but that was in my head. So when he said he already had someone, I generally thought he was texting a girl like from down the street or texting this one girl that I think at Circle K that tried to get his number like I seriously, seriously thought he was cheating on with me cheating on me with someone local so when he said it over the stream it made my fucking chest burn you know that feeling you get with your heart sank and you just gotta keep it cool I kept it cool for the stream but as soon as I logged off I was like he could not be cheating on me already I just made the joke and you tell him you already got someone I was upset she is my current girlfriend and we like to call each other fiance because we have the dreams and hopes to get married one day he said that my chest kind of burned i played it cool for twitch and then i got off and i just didn't want to talk to him no more i was like you know what but 
this is what happens. Like, I have this idea in my head that no matter how low you find someone at, no matter how much you try to build them up, speak life into them, do a bunch of shit to make their life better, when it comes down to it, like I said, I said this to myself, that person will leave you for anybody. You, ne- you never have nothing on lock. No one is ever just so lucky to have you. You're, you. Everybody is replaceable when I heard him say that. So I got to the point where I was like, I kind of had a thought in my head where, or a little talk to myself that, look, man, that this this is kind of what you ask for in a weird way. You can't be mad. Just please take care of yourself and don't let this upset you. That's what I told myself. I told myself he can do what he want to do. I, I'm going to make myself my own plan and I will leave accordingly because I do not respect that he's been talking to someone for almost three years. I have no idea what you mean. What the fuck are you? You was just... Okay. And you you didn't just fart hard as fuck in a mic and it va- vibrated the whole house? <laughs> the whole house. <laughs> that it was an earthquake. That's the case. <laughs> Our house would not be standing if I farted that hard. <laughs> As of tonight was a very, very eye opener. And not that she saw it. I'm going to try to speak it into reality. I will try my best to explain everything. But you would have to hear some clips from our streams to really understand for yourself. I'm a regretful person. And plus, he kind of made a little bit of threat. It wasn't a real threat. He was just saying, you know, if we can't figure this out, you know, I'm probably going to leave when the lease ends. But realistically, I'm like this person who gets regrets. So I try to follow everything through. I try to follow up, double confirm. I will reach out to a motherfucker 472 times just to see if there's any way we can repair the relationship. This goes for friendships, family members. I generally don't like having bad air, and I I will borderline harass a person trying to see if we can come to a, a common ground, and most people don't have time for it or don't want to talk, but at this point, Mario did want to talk, so I said, fuck it, I can't be acting fake on the stream and then get off the stream and treat you cold, let's go ahead and talk about it, you say you was thirsty, let's go to the store, and I want you to tell me everything, I'm going to give you a little speech, and then I want you to tell me everything about this person. When y'all met, how did this start? Because I am appalled. Follow along if you can. So, listen in on this part. Oh, your farts are crazy, bro. You call my my farts stink, but your shit sound like like it sound like pre-recorded farts. Like if someone ever played a fart sound, it sound exactly how your shit sound. Is that you? Nah, but. I see you running around, but you know, that's not me you looking at. Calls for help this you? Recommended yeah. Model, what are we models. supposed to be doing next? Okay, so already, there's the first part. That's the first part I need you guys to understand. I'm pretty sure you're like, what are you talking about? The game we are playing is called Skyforge. Skyforge, I don't really need to introduce it. Just know it's a computer game and you could play with massively amount of friends at the same time but did you hear that little robot in the background go to igno monsters and find information about Nerion. hey hold on how do i go to the uh there we go <laughs> oh you know we could do something called challenges <laughs> Ignan Marion, there you go. Ignan Man- Manas, whatever. I can't say that. Anyways, yeah. What's our daily challenges? I don't know. Uh, let's see. You said we could do something. That's challenge. Like, like it's a quest or something, right? It says challenges. Let's read it. Season <laughs> character campaign. Uh, let's see if I can add us to it. Okay, I guess it's nothing serious, I guess. General campaign. Oh, just tell me how to adventures. Oh, yeah, kill, eliminate 100 balls. Yeah, it's like regular stuff you got to do. So eliminate 100 bosses, you get something. Eliminate 1,000 bosses, get S rank, blah, blah, blah. Accept the package. What package? Okay. They're giving away free shit? Mm-hmm. Okay. 
All right, so what are we supposed to be fighting next in the Providence? I, I'm completely lost. Mine say go to Igna Monastery. What is it? Which is like, if you click on a map, it's like under province. It's on the what, nigga? Campaign. Oh, Igna Manassas? Manassas? Yeah, yeah, that one. Okay, I'm in it. Oh, we need to party up. Hold on. We are in a party. Oh. Damn, I almost fucked It up. never took us off. Dope. 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 So, if I gave you three months to find a bad bitch, and you're able to woo her, and, and you know, actually find someone that's better than me, could you succeed? We in the car and we talked about it. And this is what the part where I might get a little disrespectful, but kind of is what it is. So I give him my speech saying, you know, I think this for the best. This really somebody, cause like a whole time I'm thinking this is somebody he can drive to right now and they can have a conversation. He can go lay up with him. So I'm like, hey, this kind of for the best. We had a terrible past. I love you, but it seemed like if you found someone and you're talking about it like she's so serious, then it sounds like I'm slowly out the picture. You just was never gonna tell me. Yes. 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 Better than me. <laughs> Give better sloppy than me. I can't uh, any, I anybody know. anybody give better sloppy than me. No cap. Oh, I forgot See. how to play, bro. On my mama. Then he starts to tell me about the girl, and he tells me that he known her since 2019, never seen her face, never Facetime, any phone call they had. The girl does not speak, so I'm screaming catfish vibes, but he's not seeing it and to me that's kind of like a sweet gullible innocence of him but at the same time it's almost like you do not know this person they live miles away and you've never heard their real voice and you're telling me you're in love with that person to the point where you think that person is help me you were doing good last i mean i got the aggro so you just need to help kill him oh yeah i i remember i remember the day Yeah, I remember what to do now. One second, I need to pick. I need to change my volume on this game because it's louder than I last remember. Okay. Yeah, me too. Me too. On everything. I'm not really that good at talking. And this is, as you see now, this is me. This is how I normally act. This is my, this is how I usually play. This is how I usually am throughout anyone I play the games with. You know, I'm I'm naturally just vibing out. And I naturally just saying stuff that come first to my mind. So turning the volume down was something that kind of add on to what I'm trying to say. But yes, continue to listen, please. Me too. I had to change it. She has some controller problems right now, but I just, I just love how her character just walking forward on her own, like walking on straight towards the enemies. Like she's, like she just finna destroy them all in one hit. It just looks so like badass. Better than me, and I'm like the whole time it's definitely a fucking catfish for what I can hear, but I can't fake on the girl like. What she's been giving him is what I ha haven't been giving him. She's just a listening ear. Like, seriously, for years, she has just been listening to this guy talk, you know, reading his messages and keeping up with him without saying too much back. And, you know, it was just weird to come to that realization that I, it was nothing to worry about. But at the same time, if he's telling me he's kind of in love with her, that's trash as fuck because I'm here cooking for you, washing clothes, finding trips for us, saving money, working hard to look at our trips, and you're telling me you falling in love with a bitch that don't say a word back to you? That if you call her, it's going to be complete silence over that phone? I was, again, appalled. And like I said, I can't steal foolish shit on it because she gave him something that I don't give that much, which is a listening ear. But boy, it was hard to hear, so I thought he was cheating this whole time. You know, I sound like a... I sound like a, a scrub on your stream. You are a scrub, though, homie. No, I don't want to scrub. It's like somebody would stop by and they'll watch your stream, hear me talking, and be like, ugh. 
I'm out. <laughs> yeah. Lame ass nigga. Lame ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I bet they be like, ooh, a girl game streamer? I wonder if I can get with her. Hey, you guys, it's my boyfriend. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh, everything. Just to wrap this up, it was just, I felt like he was cheating, but I wasn't like mad about it because, like I said, I didn't feel threatened. But it's also, like I said, that sad thing of where, how can you fall in love with someone who don't do a quarter of what I do for you? I ain't even like a top-notch baddie streamer girl. There be some girls out there that just got big titties and stream all day. You got big titties. Eh, big titties ain't always like, it depends. They gotta be perky too. My titties sag just a little bit. I don't wear bras no more. It's, it's to be expected. Hmm, it's still sexy. Um, In my opinion. Of course. When, when, when the last time you suck? Okay, we need to stop before I get banned. <laughs> I mean, you could have, like, put it in another way and I would have answered accordingly. When the last time you mm, blah, 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 these titties? <laughs> you ain't uh, never heard that one? Of, damn, what's that nigga <laughs> name? Damn, Orlando Bloom, when he did... You don't know the, you don't know the joke. It's cool. But anyway, when the last time you did that to the bitties? That's um, what I thought. Last year? I don't know if this is going to make the video cut, but I just want to say Charm is awesome, and she was and is the biggest blessing of my life. I honestly sometimes don't see that, as much as I like to say I do understand it, but just as me watching and editing this video of along with you guys like it just makes me it just op it just makes me realize even more how much special how much how lucky i really am she she really is special and charm i love you you <laughs> oh my goodness but yes i do yes i love you a lot see my eyebrow like, I know he's going to address it. I know he's going to tell me how much he appreciates me, but it never translates into real life. Like, half his family hate me. He has talked to them about me like I'm a dog. They have talked about me like I'm a dog. Like, straight up, his mama say I got a smart mind. Like, if I go to them, be like, be like y'all hate me. Y'all hate me. No, be like, no, no, we don't hate you. You just got a smart mouth. When they got fucking bad mouths, they, they will say, his mom has said things to me that'll make a grown man want to pop this bitch in the face. Like, I am I'm not trying to be rude. I know this is his mom, his lovely dearest, but she has broken my soul. Damn, it's really been that long? I don't know. Has it? I, I think so. I feel like yeah. it has been. We barely do it. And I'm fine with that. Why? I mean, what the fuck I'm gonna do? Am I healing you? What What is this move I do? Am I healing you or taking him out? I I can't really tell. You're going to have to just read your skill description right. at this point. Damn, why is this nigga taking forever? Is he like a mini boss? Let's see. He got 5,000 HP. And according to our damage, we doing like... We doing like... 180 per hit some no not per hit like 180 at our strongest hit but we're doing like 18 oh, damage per second okay so we doing we need to go upgrade our weapon we're missing something this shit getting too hard for us like yeah we're missing something i can't believe we surviving though yeah Damn. i think the only reason is we surviving Ooh, I'm, on 50, I'm on 15 percent bro how do i heal can i stay back and heal Oh, I died! Try. I straight up died, bro. Um, okay. I may have to make two parts to this video. I really don't want to. But as I said in the beginning, I do feel like the game is trying to point us in a direction of what we need to work on and better ourselves in real life. But overall, this is all for entertainment. You know, video games are meant to have fun. 
maybe me personally, I'm just taking it to another level of understanding. So if you're still here, stick around. It is about to get there. I need you to continue to follow along. Continue to follow along with what I'm trying to explain. Thank you for your patience. Like his fam was the worst they said. It's broken my soul on many occasions. Now he's getting to the point where he's starting to defend me and things are getting better. We're leaving him alone. But during the time being, it was always hurtful. And I can never express that because it was, I'm talking about someone that's very dear to him. Like she might not like me. She might have done terrible things to me, but she treats him like a king. So how could he ever hate his own mother? You know, like how could he ever address that when she grown and she can do what she want? But like I said, I've been through so much with this kid and the fact that some girl from 2019 can swoop in and not say a single fucking word and have his heart a part of his heart it just pissed me off but i i, I mean it's, it's not much to say this is honestly embarrassing for me like i know i'm human and i talk about all my problems because nigga i'm human can't nobody judge me but god but in in most moments i fear for what i've become and i feel like i'm losing myself to please others yeah okay Dang, you ain't got no what what was I doing to get to lose all my HP? Like did I heal you? Did I give you my HP? Or am I trash? You wasn't giving me HP. I really don't know how your HP just dropped. Okay. That sucks. Making this video is actually a little more depressing than I thought it it would be. I tried to come make this video with good spirits, high spirits, you know, with the excitement of, oh, I'm about to show you guys something new. But honestly, the more I watch it, as time goes on, the longer I see what's happening, it kind of sounds like a sad story. But yeah, I'm crossing fingers, keeping off fate, and not losing hope that everything would be okay. So I boom, know they get on boom, my nerves. Boom, 5K to find a better bitch than me. How you going about it? Why are you so interested in how this is happening? Because I don't think it can happen, and I think you capping. I think you capping so hard, Mari. You're scared of girls. At the same time, you're asking for a heartbreak if it was true. Nah, I won't break my heart. I, I got much more um, strength than you think. I will actually be so surprised and so shocked. And I'll be like, you know what? You can have a second girlfriend. No worries, dude. Just keep put that paying on, her. Put that on something. Put that Bro, on Yanni. Bro, as long as you keep... Put that on Yanni. As long as you keep paying the bills at this bitch, you are free to do what you want, bro. Yes, sir. I just want to see if it can happen. And if she actually a bad bitch and good looking and have all these qualities, even a great personality, who would I to be like, nah, you can't fuck with her? That seemed like a cool person in general. But I just don't think you have the strength. So I'm trying to see what you talking about. Because I personally don't think I can find nobody better than you if I'm keeping it real. I didn't say no one's sexier. I didn't say no one want more money. I'm saying someone that's just better than you as an individual. I don't think I can find that. Not trying to gas you. You know, that's a very... <laughs> yeah, that's a very strong compliment. It's like a terrible compliment, but a compliment at the same time. Like, you had to... <laughs> you so must said, be feeling no pride when you said that. Like you put all your pride aside when you said that. I want to say, oh, please tell me you can go back. I'm yeah, I'm behind here. Except, well, I gotta accept a resurrection, bro. Just make me alive. The video here, don't know how he's gonna move forward and what he's gonna say, but I'll end the video saying, I I care about this man deeply. I hate that all our problems have to be down there televised or it always gets so bad and it can never just be fixed with a simple conversation over brunch or breakfast it's always so much with our emotions because he's completely different from me like love him to death but 
he is definitely a weird guy i'm definitely an annoying bitch and we were trying to make this shit work the best we can and um like i said i don't think i could find anything better out there he told me he could find someone better and he already did i generally in my heart truly believe that if i leave this man i will be single for the rest of my life or i will be in a very loveless relationship i do think i struck gold with mario like i think I can't get nobody better than him. I really got lucky to meet him, and I should be grateful every day. And I just find it weird that he doesn't feel the same way, but he'll tell you he do. Do you want to continue this or see if we can get stronger? I think we should see it, yeah, because it's, it's going to get worse. I'll take some of this shit, and yeah. How do I... I see... Okay, some of these people got 800... Yeah, I think that was just a mini boss. Okay. But he had 5,000, and they got 800 HP. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Yeah, that was a mini boss for sure. Uh, how can I put this? I mean, you said some Damn. really strong lines. Hold on, pause, pause. I just walked up to this bitch and I had a hundred HP. Now I'm at thirty six. Something, I'm, something is draining me. Is it one of your skills? Is it? Wow, what type of skill is that, bro? I died! I died! And I'm fighting for a... Okay, I gotta leave. Mark, can we at least leave? Something's off. Yeah, I'm about to die too. How do, how do, just die. Wait, yeah, if you... I don't know how to leave. I don't know how to leave, so... Just die, just die. Uh, okay. Yeah, we... Do you want me to revive you? No. No, I want to leave this fucking... Wait, why are you... I thought I told you to die because I don't know how to leave. Oh, okay. They finna kill me. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> no, they was not up. funny. <laughs> Your ass flopped down. Wait, no, okay, what the hell? Oh, it's hilarious. Oh, why, why is it saying we both can resurrect, though? What's resurrect? Start F11, killer. F12. Try F12. F12? Yeah, that's how uh, I say No, that's great shot. Okay, I, hold on. I, I went to the menu. Oh, leave adventure. It's leave adventure. Exit. All right. You left, right? No. Oh, you got to do it yourself then. Then it says settings. Like, okay, you click the setting button. And then at the top, uh, the very top, the first top row of everything, it might be like pictures, all this. You click leave adventure. Now, the next question is, you found it? I see what you're talking about, but I can't bring my mouse up. My mouse cursor. Ooh. Um. Durability. Switch. Use. <coughs> I'm already using that, folk. What are you? Sword? Something not right. Oh, abilities. Do I get a new ability? I need to explain to you. The music I listen to is depressing music and you know, we get in the car, we drive and my first go-to and most favorite artist to listen to is Juice World, 999. But you know, also when I'm back in my room, back in my space, my area, I listen to songs to isolate myself, which is sad boy music. And, you know, it's getting to the point where I'm, I'm kind of separate. I notice the separation. Like, if I was to bring the sad music into my car music, I can only, I can only go insane for That don't mean nothing to me. Exit the game? No. So you say it's at the top, and you said it's next to... 
So at the very top where it says premium current, like it's the very, if you just click the up button all the way, you'll see premium current events and then leave adventure. Next, it's right next to photo mode, probably. No cap, this chick that she's talking about, there is some feelings between me and that person, more on me feeling that person, but it's a lot to it that hasn't been explained to you directly, Charm. I don't think anyone can relate to me on this part, but you know, if you're an introvert, don't like to socialize, and you're in the same predicament when I'm in, to where you don't have to go out there and live a normal life. It's either one or two things that can happen. You're going to end up finding yourself in some big trouble, or you're going to end up just losing the person that you really are. And the parts you don't understand is the reason why I'm really connecting with this girl is because she she connects with my she connects with my the best I can say so the very top row that you can click on anything number of tracked objects exceeds acceptable limits sensors overheating <sighs> reboot required Reboot required? That's my machine telling me something wrong with his ass. That's the part I need to point out. That don't mean nothing to me. Exit the game? No. So you say it's at the top, and you said it's next to... So at the very top where it says premium, current, like it's the very... If you just click the up button all the way, you'll see premium, current events, and then leave adventure. Next, it's right next to photo mode, probably. So the very top row that you can click on anything. Number of tracked objects exceeds acceptable limits. Sensors overheating. <sighs> Reboot required. Reboot required? That's my machine telling me something wrong with his ass. While we play in these games, it's like the game is also it's also guiding us through life. It's it's telling us what we need to get better, what we need to work on. And I feel like nobody understands this but me. Obtain a scout report by fulfilling directors and killer bosses. Go to the in okay. <sighs> I don't, I don't like games that just don't lay out what to do right there in my face. I don't want to have to, like, fucking search for what to do. By the way, I'm going to need the Xbox controller back. The, these controls are... I mean, I can deal with it. I really can deal with it. Let me chill out. I don't know why my lips glitch out. Like, sometimes it don't pick up my lip movement. This app is so weird. Obtain a scout report by fulfilling directors and killer bosses. Go to the in okay. I don't, I don't like games that just don't lay out what to do right there in my face. I don't want to have to like fucking search for what to do. By the way, I'm gonna need the Xbox controller back. The, these controls are. I mean, I can deal with. It. I really can deal with. It. Let me chill out.